What is going on guys? My name is GAJ, or I can my channel would say. Welcome to Pokemon Platinum episode 11. Last episode was a very long episode and we, well I showed you what, um, what I'd done to beat the, um, the gym leader and we got to here to Silesian Town and we went through Silesian Ruins. You got the um, HMO5 default as well and a few other items. This episode I think we're going to do all the battles up and around here. Um, pick up the berries to start with. So I think, I think that's what we'll start off by doing is um, we we'll do these battles and then we'll go from there. So let's, go, let's check our team in a minute. Uh, we will go back and heal up. So we'll just go quickly heal up our team. Um, so yeah, there's not really a lot to show in this town. Um, it's quite a small town, it's only really the Pokemon Center. Um, Pokemon Center, Pokemon Daycare Center here. Um, so we just go sort of now that well now that we've been to the uh, ruins and got what we needed from there, we're gonna make our way up now. Um, let's have a look at the map. We're gonna see about going up this way now. We can't. We we'll have to go up to see where this here is. Uh, let's zoom in so. Okay, okay. Um, so we we'll go there and then we're just gonna go all the way across to Veilstone City, I think. We go to Veilstone City next. We try and get there um, in this episode. So yeah, that's the target for this episode. Let's go ahead and do this. We'll get on a bike to go up this way. Ooh. There we go. Up we go. Um, I don't want to get. I don't want to stay on my bike. So we've, got, we've already done that battle. That's not bad. The battle here. Um, I'm a rookie breeder, but I'll do my very best. So we've got another breeder, so she can have a fair amount of Pokemon that we have to battle against. Oh, only two. Usually breeders have a lot more, so I'm guessing it's gonna be a Magpie and a. Oh, it's not Electabuzz, is it? What's the first one? I think they introduced a new one for Electabuzz, like the first of all form for Electabuzz. I can't remember now. We'll find out. Um, um refresh my memory. So this might be faint attack, didn't do too much, 16 damage was that, not too much. We'll use Warp Pulse, super, or it will be super effective, almost a 1 KO. Um, Ember, shouldn't do too much on us, nope. Uh, another Warp Pulse, and I'll take out this Magby. So that's 1 out of 2 done. So now, next up is, oh, that's a lot of XP. Uh, oh, Togepi, I thought it was, um, I was completely wrong then. Togepi, we got a Togepi as well. Um, but yeah, we're just gonna take out this Togepi real quick. Water Pulse will do the job. Will it be a one hit? No, no, no. Yawn, okay, so we're gonna fall super soon. So we're gonna use another Water Pulse. Um, okay, it didn't confuse itself. Metronome um, can use any move then out of like. Oh, hundreds of moves. It's a very interesting move, Metro. Um, we're gonna use a Awakening to wake up our Shellos. It's in real attack move. I think Togepi can learn. I can like tackle something. Um, so use Encore. Not bad. So we oh, we we'll go up and use Water Pulse, and this will take out Togepi. Then, yep. So that's two out two done. Shallow's got fringe and 6 for XP. Almost level 27 now. We're, we're slowly getting there. Um, Shallow's has, has caught up though, so I think we might switch out soon. Uh, Jinxie, we can't go up this way just yet. What's this? Uh, Caffeine Cabin, freshly squeezed milk. Let's go have a look in here. Uh, oh wow, lots of people. Um, Cider, no, they're probably talking about a Cider just over the next to this building. Discussion over Pokemon and the white clips. Oh, okay, we've got a battle. Sweet. Here we go. Battle time. One Pokemon, and he's got a Heracross. Very nice. That is a bug fighting. Uh, not something you see every day. That's what I was expecting. We're going Mud Bomb. Brick Break. Wow. Okay, that wasn't effective. I wasn't sure if it would be or not. We're definitely going to switch out then. Sorry, we will be super effective. Well, quad 
on it because it's quad week times four week to flying. So Star Raven will do alright in this. Airways Wow, I need Airway Brick Break. Uh we we use our wing attack. Super effective. And we took it down. Heracross is done. Shell's got 500 and Star Raven got 500. So Star Raven could level 28 now. That's amazing. And it wants to move the whole area waste, nice. It definitely teach that move. Area waste is a good move. It um it never misses. It does 60 damage. Um I don't think I don't think it's like quick attack where you attack first, but because it's so quick, a Pokemon can't like not be hit by it. It's got it, it just just it always hits. And we're gonna battle over here. So yeah, area waste is a is a decent move. Uh one Pokemon again and it's a munchfax. Never, never poop when I think introduced in this. Um, you have to breed a Snorlax holding a certain incense, I think, or license, um, for it to evolve, for it to lay a Munchak's egg. That's pretty cool. Um, when you put in a poop on daycare with like another Snorlax or a Ditto. We're gonna go for Raised Leaf, obviously, uh, Munchak will be a normal type, just like Snorlax. Not bad, okay. Stockpile that raises its defense, so um, we'll probably have to do another two hits, probably. Alright, one. And two. Awesome, Munchax is down. Alright, that, that was the only one. Shell School level 27. And Grow 250 as well. So, with that, is there any more battles in here we can do? Ah, there is. Okay, there's a few little battles in here we can do. Never knew about this place. Little Waitress Girl, she's got one Pokemon, a Clefairy. That's a normal type Pokemon, I think. Um, we will switch out. What should we put? Why do I. Um, it's another Grosser. No Grosser. Minimized by Clefairy. Uh, we will use Razor Leaf. Okay, cool. We don't have half damage. Cosmic Power. What does that do? Raises its defense and special defense. Not bad. Uh, we're using a raise leaf. Hopefully this will take it out. Not quite. Never cosmic power, but another raise leaf should be able to do it, so that's not too bad. Okay, raise leaf. And that is very done. Yep. Okay, Kefari is done. 181 for Shell, 181 for Gossel. Which is Katie. Okay, any more in here? Can we buy you? Uh, Moo Moo Milk, 500 ball. Yeah, do you not know we'll buy one. JJ obtained the Moo Moo Milk. Uh, I don't know what it does. 500 Poke Dollars. Oh, it restores 100. 100 points, that's amazing. It's actually really good. I might actually buy a few of those. 100 points. A super potion restores 50, and that's 700, I think. One dozen, so that's 6. So that's not bad. Um, we'll buy another, another, uh, another 6 as well. I don't know how much that's cost me. I think that's 500 for a bottle. So five to three thousand maybe. We're on three two six four. Three two six four oh. Two six. Oh wow. That's like six grand. Oh I, oh and my oh a dozen oh half a dozen six, a dozen twelve. Okay, I got thirty seven, whoops. Um Yeah, we're gonna put these up to the top. Okay, well we spent a bit more than I was hoping, but oh well, cool. 
We've got lots of those. So that's right, 100, 100 points. Oh, we're going to go back actually. Um, because. We'll battle here. I want to do all these battles um, just so I'll Oh, I haven't healed up Shalos. Whoops, we'll use one of the moon and we'll do that. Oh, I, there's another guy in there in that building as well. Uh, we'll do these battles quick and then pop back into that building. Ah, Punetta. Hopefully we're out of speed and shells can take it out. Nope, flame wheel and that'll take us out. But that's fine. I'm not too worried about that. Shells is unable to battle. Shots painted with some now. Sorry, you know. Okay. Uh, we're going to use area waste. Not bad. Uh, we're using oh, ember for that bonus. No. Arrow waste again. And that is Pernet done with. 781 XP, that's not bad. Okay. Alright. Let's go back this way. We'll go heal up our team. Okay, let's go heal up. Yes, I would like to hear my Pokemon. Um, okay, our six Pokemon are in there. Awesome, let's go carry on doing these battles. Uh, try and get as many as we c can do. Um, give our Pokemon some XP. I'm just going to check the town map. You know what? I think we are gonna go back this way, and I'm gonna catch a new Pokemon for our team. Well, um, that's that's all. If I can, um, that's if I can go down this way. I'm hoping I will be able to. Uh, sorry about that, my mum just uh, came in. Alright, let's carry on going this way then. So, we're gonna go this way. I'm hoping we'll be able to go down here, can we? No, we can't, unfortunately. Oh, that sucks. So, we can't go that way yet. Um, I was hoping we, we might be able to. I wasn't 100% sure. So, the Pokemon I want to catch, um, we can't quite go ahead and get there just yet. Not to worry. Uh, we'll go back up here and carry on with the battles. Uh, way. Oh yeah. Okay, sorry about that again. Like literally two minutes later she comes in. Um. Anyway, so here there's a battle. You can battle with Pikachu because you can see a Pikachu here and you think, oh cool, let's catch a Pikachu. Hi, I'm a Pikachu. What? It's not a Pikachu. It's a trainer. So they'll go just as Pikachu. And she's got a Pichu, my apologies, it's a Pichu, not a Pikachu. Okay, you can battle P uh, Pichu then here. Um, level 22, so we'll go quickly do that. I forgot about this battle at the start. On my way to the fruit. So we'll quickly do this one. Raise the leaves. Hopefully that will take it out. And it does. Okay, Pichu's done. 198. Okay. Okay, now we're going to carry on going up this way. Back down to the well, up this mud slope and into Salatium Town. Uh, okay, cool. Let's go. Um, we'll get off a bike on this route here and then back on it again. And oh, okay. Moving it up, and you immediately go into these battles here. Um, kind of hard to miss, I guess. Unless you're very skilled. Um, so yeah, we've got these double bars. We're going to do them anyway, so it's no biggie. So they've got a Pikachu and a Clefairy. Both level 20 for them, both female. We're going to have Grottle and Shellos for this. I'll probably use Grottle and use um, Razor Leaf and Shellos for use Hot. Um, wait, don't hit him, Pahit. No. I thought. I, I thought. No. 
Actually, Mud Bomb would be super effective on Pichu, so we'll use that. We use Razor Leaf. Um, hoping we can do decent damage on the Clefairy. Okay, we almost took the Pichu out there. I should re attack the Clefairy. So we use Mud Bomb, which is super effective on Pichu, so I'll definitely take it out. So that's Pikachu dealt with. Uh, one down, one to go. 201 XP for both of them. Um, Clefairy is minimized. Uh, which raises um, evasiveness. So we use Razor Leaf, and I'll probably go for Water Pulse this time just because of higher accuracy and same type of attack bonus. So Razor Leaf, and in fact, I might just do it. It does. Awesome. Coral got 161, Engine 66, and a good level 27. Chess is already. Oh, Mega Drain. Awesome. But we'll get rid of um, Absorb because they both do the same. But Absorb does 20 damage, Mega Drain does 4 ways, so swap one, get the um, time move one, I guess. No Mega Drain. And Shell's got Engine Wound 66, 66 as well. 1400, and what we are going to do also is going to go on and grab the um, Amulet Coin off Shell's and give it to Grottle, because Grottle could be up front for us. So we want to get out. Um, Double the money from trainer battles, which is always handy. So up this way, a battle. Yep, there's a battle here. Um, there's an item as well, just above us. So we're gonna, after we've done this battle, we're gonna go head on over and grab that item. I'm not sure what the item is, so it'd be a surprise to me. Uh, we've got a Pokemon Breeder, Edicid. There we go. That's the one I was trying to go on about earlier. So it goes Edicid, um, Electabuzz, Electivire. Um, I just couldn't think of the first one, Edicid. There you go. That's what I was trying to work out earlier. So I look at uh, you shockwave again it's like uh, that moves like error rate and never misses. It always hits the opponent unless it uses um unless it, um like for well this uh, this move because it's a electric move you can't touch ground pick once so at the same time it wouldn't hit or um or if the um opposing Pokemon used um protect. So that's not too bad. Um Happini, I think, I think Happini evolves into Chanter, which evolves into Blissey, and they're all normal types. Uh, very good HP, just not very good defense. Gives us very good H um, XP, wow, wasn't expecting that. 2200 as well for winning, and we got this item, which is Super Repel. Awesome, um, we will use that eventually, so I'm going to go back up here now, and check in this building here. Because there's one more dude that was um, in the corner here. Oh, it looks like a female actually. Howdy, travelers. Okay, no, it went battle. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Let's head on out and carry on route 210 over this way. 215 now. Um, anything up here? Just a honey tree or tree to, to um, put honey on? Um yeah, we we'll go with this. That should be alright. Okay, we got our first battle route two on five. Uh it's a bronze ore. Um so we'll, we will have to switch Grot grotto out because it won't be very effective on it. It's a psychic steel. Again, I don't have anything super effective on it. Um, and I don't think a grass move will do particularly good. So I don't think I think grass is not very effective. Yeah. Oh, that was a quick word. Extrans Extransessory. Can't pronounce that one. Uh rain continues to fall down. So we are gonna switch out now into oh, we'll give we'll let shell from this. So level twenty seven, um we use water pulse on it. We use confuse ray. Not a bad move, I guess. Uh, we will go for the um, water pulse. Okay, water pulse. We hit it. That's awesome. Um, how much damage do we do? Not too much. Um, we'll go for another one, hopefully we'll hit this one as well. Uh, water pulse. Sorry, hit the mic there. Hurt myself in confusion. 
Hypnosis, trying to put us to sleep now. I don't want that to happen. So we're gonna go for War Pulse again. Um, we're confused, obviously, and we hit ourselves in confusion again. Extrends the sorry, I think. I'm trying to read that quick. Um, we use another water pulse. Okay, there we go. We finally hit. Been waiting for us to hit. Okay, and that's Bronzor, Bronzor down. 177, 177. Uh, two Pokemon then. If there's another one, oh Sheldon. Okay, we should be okay against this Pokemon actually. Uh, we're gonna keep battling. Um, it's a Rock Steel, I think, or Ground Steel. We will be super effective on it and not quite a one KO. Close though. Iron defense sharply raises defense stat, which isn't too bad a move. Uh, we use water poles. Okay, well that's Sheldon gone. Okay, and that's um the bug manic dude dealt with. Karen going this way. Oh, there's an item here. And Max Ether. Um, so this guy seems to be guarding it, so we will just walk up. Oh no. Ah, he's not. He was just walking around it. Okay, cool. Uh, next up, we've got this guy over here. Um, I think this one you can skip. So um, we're not going to skip it, we're going to send out Staravia. Oh, what one about? Oh, what a nice lad. He gave us a TM66, which I think I saw them, the word payback. Payback. It's a dark move. Cool. TM66, there. Eh? Okay, next up. Put this guy down here. We will do the battle, but we will go for the um, we'll cut down that tree as well. We just won't go for the tall grass. Okay. Alright, one Pokemon. Krogunk, level 26 and poison fighting. So we'll set obviously have Saravia, he'll, he'll be super effective. Aerial Waves. Super effective, and it's down. Okay, Krogunk is down. Level 26 as well, not bad. 462. Okay. Cut down this tree, we've got Bidoof for that. That's why I love Bidoof. A little HM save. Um, battle here, but we get an item out of it, so kind of all win win. Get some XP and an item. And we skip tall grass, I think. Um, you've got three Pokemon. A matchup is the first one, fighting, so we're super effective with Staravia. Okay. We have aerial waves. Okay, one at KO, one down, two to go now. The ring continues to pull down. Uh, another matchup, that's fine, we we'll keep the area in. Another aerial waves. Another hit, another one hit KO, yep, and then maybe, a, ooh, yeah, we should level up. Yep, level 29 now, sorry for you. Starting to pull ahead of the group. And a third and final matchup, level 23. We're going to use another area way, so I'll take out the matchup. One hit. And that will give us some more XP. Okay, Black Belt Gregory. Uh, what's the item here then? Fist Plate. I think that raises fighting moves. That's not bad. Not bad item to pick up there. Trinity, Pokemon Tires, Passes. 
Zubis, okay. Okay. What's down there? What's down this way though? Ah, no. We got a hyper potion. Cool. Um, there's some berries there. I'll probably come back off screen and pick those up. Uh, we got wild power here. We the gains and abra. Nothing too much. We just run from this. Uh, we don't get a lot of XP from it, so. Okay, run. Awesome. Uh, okay, we'll break this tree then. Might as well. Belief use cut. Okay, the tree. And down the battle here. Obviously, we can skip that. The item there. Um, I will go back and do that. We're close now to the. Um, Shockwave, nice. That's the um, another move that never misses. We will teach that to Pokemon if they can learn it. Um, I'm not going to be having an electric Pokemon on my team, so we will teach it to all, if one of them can. Nope. Bidoof can. Bidoof can learn like everything. Um, what else do we have that we can learn? We'll teach Shadow Crawl. We'll save that. Self Rock will save. Brass not. Uh, no, we, we, no, we won't teach. Okay, we won't teach any moves. We go up here, and we're going to do the battle here. See what you, sh you should hopefully have a fighting Pokemon, which will be super effective. On we've got three. First one, a Krogunk, level 21. Sorry, Avia. We use Aerial Waste just so it's super effective, and we can. Get this um, battle done a bit quicker. So, area ways. Super effective. One hit KO. And Krogan's down. One down. Two to go. Uh, matchup is up next. So, we'll keep battling. Matchup is level 24. Area ways. Okay, nice. Okay, matchups down. And finally, last big one is a Meditite, a psychic fighting. So we had a pure fighting, a psychic fighting, and a poison fighting. Not bad. Okay. And that's Meditite done. Sorry, we've got 400. Sorry, it was almost level 30. Now, when it gets level 30, we'll stop using it um, just so the others can catch up. Is there something down there this way that we can get? Oh no. Ah, if you didn't use um, cut over there, you couldn't skip this battle. Um, is this do the um, battle? I think down here there's another item here. We'll grab this. A full heal. Not bad. Um. Okay, so now we've got a double battle coming up here. If I remember correctly, they have very strong Pokemon. And so, just just in case they do, because I'm not sure if they actually do or not, if I remember correctly. I am going to heal up real quick. Just like that. Do I have a normal potion? No, but we have got berries. In fact, what we will do is go... Give us the Shellos and give that to Staravia just in case. You never know when an Orange Berry might be, might, might be needed. We use Orange Berry then. You? Okay, that'll do. Okay, we've got a double battle then. Um, I could have done these individually, but we'll do it as a, as a double battle. Now, um, see how it goes. Okay, this is the last battle before we get to Veltone City. They both have, wow, three Pokemon each. Starting off with Gligon Rosendia. Okay. I think I sent out the two, my two good options for this. So, we're gonna go with Aerial Ways on Rosendia, super effective. Water Poles on Gligon are also super effective. Rosendia is down, hopefully. 
Yes, okay, Roselia is down. One down, five to go. Sorry, we've got 390. Shell's got 390. Glygo used faint attack on Shellos. That's fine, we should be able to take a hit. Yep. Water Pulse, super effective. Don't know if it'll take out on one hit though. Not quite, but that's fine. Um, who's next? Oh, yeah, because it's raining, it um, increases our um, water damage. So use aerial waves on Gligar, I reckon, just to take it out quicker, and then we use um four pulse and roll. Okay, Gligar is done. Two out of six done. Star is now level thirty, and Shellos isn't level twenty eight just yet. Roll is down. Awesome. Okay, four. Is that four? No, that's three. Three. Get a bit ahead of myself. Alright, that's well that's half their Pokemon done with. Three down, three to go. A Boizel and a Licky Tongue. Okay, so we're gonna have to focus our attacks on one of these. So I think we'll take out the Licky Tongue first. Um I think it'd be fairly strong to take out. So we'll try that one first. Um we we'll use aerial waves and then water pulse on it. Yeah, I thought it would be a bit difficult to take out. Um, okay. What we will do is we go aerial waves, Pokemon, and bring Rotter then. We'll try this. Oh, he's Pursuit. Clever. Um, that move always. I'll move or attack um, just before you switch out or yeah, I think that move was still attack even if you used um, the tech as well so that's the Licky Tongue done uh, Shell's grew to level 28 now and Grohl grew to level 28 as well awesome okay who's next uh, oh, okay um, Razor Leaf as well Aqua Jet always attacks first, bringing us 40 damage. But with the rain, it will increase maybe. There you go, here's the Oran Berry. Awesome. Aerial Waste, and then Razor Leaf will definitely finish it off if this doesn't do it. Okay, and we've got Razor Leaf now. Super effective. Okay, that's Weasel done. Last one to go now. Okay, it is a. Drift Blim. Um, oh, actually, we go Aerial Waves and no bites. There we go. Aerial Waves should do a decent amount. This is the evolved form of Drift Blim. For those of you who didn't know, Gust. Tap. I'm sorry for some reason. This would be super effective. Awesome. Okay. That's that done. Nice. Aravia and Grossel. Okay. Alright, and now, my phone's going off for background. We'll, again, I'll grab those berries off screen. I um, just don't want to waste your time. We are now. <sighs> you probably could hear a screen then. Uh, we made Phil Stone say, I'm going to end it here. Um, I've got a driving lesson in 10 minutes. But yeah, thank you very much for watching, guys. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like. Can we try and hit? Why are you shouting? Why must you shout? I'm sorry about that. So, um, please leave a like. Um, can we try and get five likes on the video? Um, I usually hit around three or four, so maybe try and push it for five. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like anyways. Um, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you next time for another video. Goodbye.